Okay, so now let's see the conversions of prefixes. Prefix to normal numbers. So this is how to convert a number with prefix to a normal number. So we can convert a number with prefix to a normal number by multiplying the number by the values of the prefix. For example, 23 kilohertz. Hertz is the unit for frequency. So if you want to write this in hertz only without the prefix, so what should we do? We multiply the number by the values of the prefix. Okay, what's the values of kilo? It's one thousands, right? Okay, one thousands. Uh, uh, actually, I prefer to write it in this uh, index form. Uh, Ten to the power of three. Uh. So twenty-three kilohertz uh, is equal to twenty-three multiplied by one thousands. Okay, so it's equal to twenty-three thousands hertz. Then uh, another example, 6.16 micrometer, micro. Micro is equal to 10 to the power of 6. Uh. 10 to the power of 6 is 1 divided by 1 million. Or is equal to 0 0.000001. Okay, so 6.16 micrometers. Uh, if you want to change it to meter, then we write 6.16 multiply. Eh? We multiply by the values of the prefix. Uh, the values of the prefix is 10 to the power of negative 6. And uh, therefore, uh, the answer is... Uh, you can give the answer in this one, okay, in this form. This is in a standard form or scientific notations. Uh, or you can write your answer in this way, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 6, 1, 6 meter. So that is how we convert a number with prefix to a normal number. We multiply the number with the values of the prefix. Eh? What's the values of the prefix? Or oh, these are the values of the prefix. Eh? These are the value. Or oh, you use this one. Okay. I actually I prefer the uh, value in standard form. Eh? In standard form. But anyway, if you have calculators and uh, you want to use your calculator, then you actually don't need to memorize this. Example one. The frequency of the radio wave is 210 MHz. What is the frequency of the radio wave in Hertz? Eh? Okay. Uh, mega is 10 to the power of 6 eh? or 1 million. So 210 MHz is equal to 210 times 10 to the power of 6. Eh? Okay. Uh, you can give your answer in standard form 2.16. I thought it's 210, sorry. Is zero, eh? sorry, sorry, 2.10 times 10 to the power of 8 eh? uh, in standard form hertz. Okay, now uh, this is not standard form, eh? okay, because standard form the real number, okay, can be uh, can only be between uh, 1 to 10, eh? okay, this is 210, so this cannot be. Uh, standard form okay so standard form you need to change this to uh 2.1 okay 2.10 for three significant figure okay the thickness of a film is 245 nanometer what is the thickness in unit meter okay nano if you check the table is equals to 10 to the power of negative 9 yeah? so therefore 245 nano Nanometer equals to what? 2, 4, 5 times 10 to the power of negative 9 meter. Okay, but is this standard form? Yes or no? No, this is not a standard form. So if it's not a standard form, then you need to convert it to standard form. Okay, so this is the number of, uh, this is the decimal point here. So we move 1, 2. Uh, okay, so it becomes 2.5. Four five okay times ten to the power of what? We move this decimal point uh, two place forwards means we divide it by one hundred. So here we divide it by one hundred, and this part we must multiply it by one hundred. Actually, what we do is uh, we have two four five times ten to the power of negative nine, right? Here we divide it by one hundred. Here we multiply by one hundred. So these two actually you cancel off then. You, it will end up that uh, the number is still the same. Uh, if this divided by 100, this multiplied by 100, then this, the, the number will be negative 7. Eh? So, you see, uh, this one, uh, we reduce the values, right? right, right from 245 uh, to 2.45. Uh, so we 
reduce the value. And this one, we must increase the value from negative 9 to negative 7. Uh, if you're not sure, then you can use your calculators. 